I'm Deepak. I'm working as a product manager at Office Solution. Today I'm going to showcase the chart which we have that is line plus bubble chart. So here we have two kind of functionalities, one for user and one for developer. So for developer we have the two options x-axis, y-axis, size, legend and tooltip. So x axis is to provide the x axis data, y axis to provide the y, y values. Then we have a size so that you can drag one more measure and on the basis of which the size of the bubble will be decided. Then we have a tooltip. If you want to see any data on the a particular data on the tooltip, suppose we currently we are seeing product and actual. Now let me drag the day, target and the target will appear here. Now we have some filter options. So uh, by default we have all the Power BI options and apart from that we have added some custom visuals, custom formatting options. This is marker shape so we can define the shape of our marker. Then we have numerical value formatter. This is for formatting the values as you can see. We have added the option as 1000, million, billion, trillion and auto. Then we have x-axis label where we can define our axis label. So as you can see here, this is changed now. Then we have visual chart styles. That is to change the style of the line we have. Then we have the line types that is solid and dotted. Then we have the bubble opacity and we, we also have the bubble size. See, now let me change the bubble opacity. Let me make it 0.5. See. Now let me make it 1. Then we have the custom tooltip options. You can change the style of the tooltip. Let me change the label type. As you can see, it turns blue. Now we have uh, the use, uh, options for the user. So we have trend line to showcase the trend line for the particular data. Then we have adjust numerical axis so that you can adjust your x, uh, y axis so that you can see that y axis value is getting changed. Similarly, you can go to the negative side also by going to the minus portion. Then we have a reference value. You can draw the, you can enter the value and just click on the toggle button and your reference line will be drawn. Let me change it to 450. This. Now we have one more option as known as flip axis. So you can flip your axis. One more option. Uh, now let me show you the legend part. Okay. So legend is drawn here. Here we have an option to change the type of the uh, legends we have. Suppose uh, brown color is showing a. Let me make it as a triangle. So you can see that this this one is changed and other have become circle. Now let me change it to uh, again change it to diamond. And then plus and then star. Okay, so we, we have an option that we can change the marker of each particular legends we have. So this is what we have.